welcome Aries I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back um, this is the abundance money and prosperity reading for the season of Sagittarian so the season of Sagittarian begins from November 22nd until December 21st I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back please remember to like and share these videos if it's your first time remember to, to like share and subscribe I hope to see you next time all right this is about your money flow and who and what is blocking your materialistic stability. so I see you ladies are going to be affected some sort of a situation is happening in the first week that is going to be affected some of you ladies um, it can be ladies on a whole it is coming up uh, as the queen of ones the energy of the queen of ones can be ladies on a whole okay um so be aware of what is happening and transpiring some of you could be having some sort of a financial instability in the first week and it's going to be affecting the ladies so ladies be aware of this that you could be ending up having some instability in your financial flow in the first week and what we're seeing is that it has to do with something you have done in the past that is affecting you now in the future ladies so be aware and align with the energy then when we look at the second week the second week is showing up some sort of an authority figure um this authority figure um is uh, um dealing with some sort of issues with you later so it could be your boss for some of you but it could also be you're doing business with this person so if you notice these energies are in reverse and however it is transpired you guys are not the first one to have reverse energies reverse energies and money is saying that you need to look out for these people some of you could be dealing with another fire sign woman and Amanda is creating some sort of an issue. This could be bosses. This could be supervisors. This could be team um, mates that is creating some sort of an instability for you. It could be people on the work floor that is affecting um, your flow. It's as if these people create some sort of an issue and you can't get to get out and move forward in a positive way. So you have to be aware and align with yourself and understand what is happening and what is transpiring because uh, what we see here that is transpiring is that you are dealing with an air sign person and this person has some sort of a management position and this person is realizing that there is some sort of instability when it comes on to your financial situation now when we look at this person um, this person is standing between you and a whole lot of money and I see some of you is going to just walk away from this because it's as if you realize, yeah, you have no win. So it could be a divorce that a divorce is finally over. But, you know, your husband is not releasing this money to you or there could be a, have been some sort of a legal issue or someone was allowed uh, awarded to pay you something but this person is not doing it so if you notice between your money there sit a aquarian gemini or libra person it could be also um a bank or financial institution let's say that your um, partner or your mother has died or your parents has died and it must be an insurance payout um, these people are standing between you and this money that you should have. So you have to be aware and align with what is coming out and transpiring because you're going to be finding out the injustice of a company or organization or it could be an insurance company where you need some sort of a financial help. You might need surgery or that. And this, these people, you're waiting for these people to say to go ahead. So that sort of an issue could be coming up when it comes on to your financial flow. Then when we look, I see some of you are just going to be taking the I road. You're going to be taking the I road and just moving away from this situation. So a lot of you, you're dealing with a whole lot of money, the nine of pentacles 
Pentacles is a whole lot of money. It's money that some of you should have received. And I see what is happening and transpiring is that uh, you, um, ladies, could be have to pay back a whole lot of money. And I see this is affecting a whole lot of you Aries that a whole lot of you Aries have to pay back a lot of money, okay? It's not coming in, you're paying it out. And I see some of you are going to just make the decision. It's not mine. Okay, let me just pay it out. So, um, Aries, this is going to be a season where a lot of you Aries is going to be pounced upon, um, that people are saying, Hey, you hold me. Um, you know, and it's a lot of money, Aries. So I see that some of you are going to let it go because you're going to be realizing, yeah, um, you know, something, um, it's not mine. I got it, um, someone, you know, however you got it, you're going to be realizing. Some of you have to pay back some money. Some of you could have a lent, um, borrow some money. And I see, um, this institution or so is going to be coming at you for the money. So I see that sort of a situation is happening. So a lot of you, um, Aries have to pay back a whole lot of money. And I see you Aries realize that there is no other way to get out of this situation. You really have to pay back the money. So I see a lot of you Aries, um, are going to be realizing Jesus. Um, if I, if I had only know, I wouldn't have created this sort of a situation because now I have to pay back all of this money. So it is some issue that is coming up for you, Aries, that uh, you did not see coming. And I see in the in the third week, uh, you have to pay back this money because the, the nine of pentacles is in reverse. So that means it's money that you have to pay back. And it's coming up uh, to the end of the reading. So it's definitely money that you pay up. If it was in the beginning, it would have been money that you were supposed to receive. So I see a lot of people, and especially when it shows up, uh, the, the, the element of uh, the sign that we are reading. And you are in the Sagittarian. You are connected to the Sagittarian because... Uh, Sagittarian is your sister sign because it's also a fire sign. And the thing about it is that you have to know whether fire, um, Sagittarian is in your birth chart. If Sagittarian is in your birth chart, you will receive this money. If Sagittarian is not in your birth chart, you are going to be paying out this money. So this is why we're doing the abundance money and prosperity reading because uh, we can look a specific on what is transpiring with that situation. It's not a general reading. It is over abundance, money and prosperity. And now you're seeing who is standing between you and the, and your money and what is happening and transpiring. And as you see, this money needs to be paid back. And I see some of you are just going to close your eyes, pay back the money and just walk away from whatever is transpiring. So, um, it is, um, it is a sad situation because there's a whole lot of money. There's no question about it. And when we have the energy uh, for the eight of cups, that means you're paying back the money and you're like, and, and, and that's, that's it for me. I do not really want to go. You know, I, I'm paying you back and let's let it go. Okay. I don't want to speak about this anymore. So whatever is happening and transpiring is as if uh, it, it is coming up that you have uh, reached a point that you realize, okay, so I'm paying back this money and I'm letting it go because this is how it, uh, um, it should be. So it's as if the universe is coming in and said, Hey, Aquarian, you have some money or you got some money or you borrowed some money and it is time for you to pay it back because this is what people do not understand is that if you borrow the words that you use, borrow, lend and that sort of a thing, that means you have to repay this money. Okay. So however, um, if you got money that was not yours, the universe is going to be realizing that and said, Hey, um, you know, Aquarian, uh, Aries, you got some money. It wasn't yours. You know that, uh, you know, look within your heart, make the right decision and pay it back. And I see that is the sort of a situation that is definitely going to be happening. And it's going to be transparent to a lot of your um, Aries in the Sagittarian period. So again, try and find out what is in your birth chart. Try and um, look at the full moon 
readings if you have an abandonment to the other channel you can look at the full moon readings in order to see what is coming up in your second house because your second house is the house of money the first house is your house so um um aries be aware of this and align yourself that uh, um, whatever the issue and the situation is, it could be some sort of a legal issue that you, um, Aries, have to pay back a whole lot of money. So that is how your money and prosperity is looking in the Sagittarius period. It's as if um, it's coming up where anything that we do have a action and a reaction. And if we borrow, we have to repay. If we lend, we have to repay. And I see that this is the situation that is going to be transpiring. And I see some of you are going to be thinking, um, Jesus, it's Christmas, and why does this have to happen now? And you're just going to be paying it out. Some of you could be shopping for Christmas. Some of you could be, um, yeah, really shopping for Christmas. So that could be one of the situation that is transpiring. And some of you could be just realizing, hey, um, is it what it is what this is? Um, I have to um pay it back. So um Aries, however way it is transparent, I see you're paying it back, letting it go, and moving forward and creating um some sort of a new but be careful how you move forward to create uh, this new stability because what is going to transpire if you return and do the same thing, um then you're not learning the lesson. So um, be aware um, what is transpired. What is good for you is to really use the blue button in order to and choose one of these. Choose one of the top four um, symbols. Choose that uh, that deck and it is going to be creating a diamond um, reading where you can um, see how um, you can better work on the situation how to create um your um stability after you pay back all of this money so use the blue button and you will be able um to see the extended of this reading because there you will um choose one because this is for thousands of people so um whatever energies you choose that is what going to be showing you the diamond of what to do. I love you guys. Gotta go. Namaste.